Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Smita. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you this beautiful double wing smoky eyeliner in just two simple steps and it gets done really quick. So if you're ready, let's get started. And if you're new here, please take a moment to subscribe. I post new videos every Tuesdays, Thursdays and Sundays. Okay, now for the first step and the most important step, you just need a sticky tape. It can be a cello tape, it can be duct tape, it can be paper tape, but it just has to be sticky. And then I'm going to cut it using a small scissor. All I need is a thin piece of triangle from the sticky tape. Just remember you can make this wider or narrower depending on how much space you want between your top and lower wing. If you want the space to be more, make it wider. If you want the space to be less, then make this triangle narrower. Now I'm going to stick this tape as an extension of my lower lash line with the tip of the triangle facing the outer corner of my eye. Now for the step number two, we will be using this tape as a stencil to smoke out our double winged liner. You can use any color eyeshadow, perhaps something that goes with your outfit. Or if you want to keep it universal, you can use a black eyeshadow like me. I'm using this one from the Sigma Nightlife palette. And the brush that I'll be using is the ColourPop E20 because it's narrow, it's small, it's easier to navigate through the corners and smoke out the wing. If you don't have this brush, you can use any small flat shader brush or a pencil brush or a definer brush. It just has to be as narrow as possible and fluffy. And I have given a couple choices in the description box right below this video. So make sure you check that out. I'm going to pick some black eyeshadow with this. And as I mentioned before, I'm going to use the tape as a stencil to draw out my outer wing. It's very easy. You don't have to be precise because the tape is going to take care of everything for you. And I'm going to keep adding more eyeshadow till I'm happy with the intensity. So you can do the same. You can add as much or as little as possible depending on how intense you want the wing to be. And as I add more color, I'm going to start smudging it by moving my brush back and forth. And as I move to the outer end of the wing, I'm going to push the eyeshadow outwards to keep the tip of the wing as sharp as possible. And I'm going to do the same in my lower lash line. I'm going to use the tape as a stencil to draw out a wing in the outer corner. And I'm going to also smudge the eyeshadow in my entire lower lash line. Most people shy away from double winged liners because it's very hard to keep that straight line between the two wings in the outer corner. But here you don't have to worry. You don't have to be precise because the tape is taking care of everything for you. That's pretty much it. And now it's time to reveal our double wing smoky liner. So I'm going to very gently pull off the tape using a pair of tweezers. And I want to be very gentle here because I'm going to use the same tape on the other eye as well. So I want to maintain the stickiness. And the reason I'm using the same tape is to maintain the size of the wings on both the eyes. And that's your two step double wing smoky liner. You can apply some mascara and call it done or add some pizzazz like I'm going to show you right now. In my lower waterline, I'm going to use a subtle gold eye pencil from Milani in the shade Gold Digger. You can also use a white or nude eye pencil. And in the gap between the wings, I'm going to be using some glitter. This is the glitter liner from Folklore and Platinum. To tightline my top lash line, I'm going to be using the Maybelline gel liner in black. This is waterproof, so it's not going to get on your lower waterline when you blink. Next, I'm going to curl my lashes, use some mascara. I'm using the Bad Girl Bang from Benefit Cosmetics. And for lashes, I'm using the ColourPop Lashes in Honey. Ah. 
I'm going to use the same tape on the other side, finish up my eye makeup and I'll be right back. To highlight my brow bones and inner corners, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Diamond Light Highlighter. And that finishes up the eye makeup. Let's finish up the rest of the face before we reveal the final look. To add some warmth to my face, I'm going to be using the Blush and Bronze Palette from Carity. For bronzer, I'm going to be using Taste. And for blush, I'm going to be using Fixation. To illuminate just the highest points of my cheekbones, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Diamond Light Highlighter once again. And on my lips, I'm going to be using the Ofra Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Mocha. And here's the completed look. How easy was that double winged liner? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you plan to recreate this look, don't forget to tag me on my socials. Everything is listed in the description box right below this video, along with all the products that I used in today's tutorial. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and share. And if you're new here, please take a moment to subscribe. I post new videos every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. I love you guys so much, and I will see you soon with a brand new video. Bye, guys.